anniversary of Unification Day. Thousands line up at the site of the Great Accord, celebrating the formation of the Advent Coalition. Keeping with their promise to humanity, 12 new gene therapy clinics will be opening in select cities by the end of the new year. Despite the attempted attack by French elements, operations at the new facility in Paris thankfully remain unaffected. In response to the unprovoked intrusion on the eve of our most beloved celebration, the speaker reaches out to us. A small number of dissidents again repeat the mistakes of the old world. Striking as we celebrate the benevolent savior who time and again offers only friendship and compassion. Yet these trivial actions could never break the bond between humanity and the elders. Peacekeeping forces have already made several preemptive arrests of known collaborators. Advent again assures all citizens that today's celebrations will continue as planned. into the city center to strike a big target. Something that will shake up the tranquil little utopia Advent has been building all these years. Secure the designated coordinates and neutralize all hostile contacts. Firebrand will be in the area for your extraction.
This one five. We have a fix on the target. Move to place the X four charges at the designated position. Confirmed. my way. Target location. These guys make up the bulk of the Advent forces we've dealt with. They're disciplined and well equipped, but their obedience makes them predictable. Orders confirmed. On the move. I'm ready to fight! We can proceed.
Menace one five, you're near the target position. No problem. Yeah. We kinda heard you. Uh, let's keep exploring, team. You won't be able to find anything if you can't even keep your eyes open. Confirmed. The Advent officers seem more capable than the grunts. We're not sure whether to chalk it up to training or stricter mind control. Target neutralized. Roger that. There you go. Coming! Moving on target location. Target neutralized. Area is secure. We're not picking up any inbound contacts. Scanners are clear. Menace 1-5, we have a limited window to act before Advent responds. We need to get those charges planted on the double. I'll take that. Through here. Menace one five, rendezvous at the extraction point. Status confirmed, squad is clear. Detonating charge.
Ranger serves as our primary reconnaissance unit, capable of moving independently in concealment while engaging enemies at close range. Operating some of our most advanced equipment, specialists deploy robotic drones on the battlefield that can be outfitted for combat or field medic. Commander to the research labs. Just like it sounds, our sharpshooters engage enemy targets with pinpoint accuracy from extreme range. They're also trained in pistol marksmanship for the occasional close encounter. Serving as our demolitions experts, the Grenadiers provide heavy ordnance delivery whenever and wherever we need it. Impressive, isn't it? Capable of generating immense power, yet completely harmless to human life. If only the same could be said for the rest of the aliens' technology, Commander. Dr. Richard Tigan, Chief Science Officer. I am responsible for the entirety of our research here, as well as the procedure you so recently underwent. Welcome to my lab, such as it is. I'm not sure what Central may have told you, but we found something while removing you from the alien stasis suit. A device implanted directly in your occipital lobe. Had I access to the equipment available to me during my tenure at Advent, I would already know the precise nature of its function. However, given time and your approval, of course, Commander, I assure you, I will find out. Which brings to light an additional point. Though aspects of this facility are indeed impressive, I am but one man. Were you to direct additional support personnel and resources to me, I could substantially improve the speed of all our research. A farewell, Commander. I do find that area of research to be among the more intriguing options available. We'll begin work immediately. I'll send word when a complete report is available. Okay, reworked your repulsors with some of the parts I salvaged from their old engine. Should fix that stabilization problem you had. Come on, Rover. It'll work. <laughs> Commander! Getting our tech to talk to theirs is harder than you'd think. Lily Shen, Chief Engineer, at your service. You were probably expecting to see my father. In all that's happened, I'm guessing Central didn't tell you yet. He's gone. Dad gave everything he had to get us this far. This entire ship is his life's work. I know he would have loved to show you around the place himself. He used to talk about you a lot. You can be sure I'm ready to finish what he started. Might not look it, but from here, I can fabricate pretty much anything you come up with. And with a little more help, well, you'd be amazed with what I can do. 
It was an honor to finally meet you, Commander. You'd be surprised how big of a difference some of these things can make in combat. With a few supplies, I can manufacture anything we need in no time. Having never stepped foot in one of the city centers, I've never actually had one of these advent burgers I keep hearing rumors about. No one really seems to be asking the hard questions either. Like, when was the last time you even saw a cow? We've done what we can to honor our fallen soldiers, Commander. It's not much, but it gives our people a chance to pay their respects. For most of our soldiers, the living quarters on board the Avenger are a step up from the conditions they've had to live with on the ground. Commander. Good to see you on your feet again. Welcome to the bridge, the nerve center of our operation. The aliens have our entire world in their grip. Advent controls everything. Government, communications, industry. Not to mention the military. And it's on us to take it all back. Resources and time are tight, Commander. It'll be up to you to decide how to best use both. The ship is yours. While we prepare for new operations and continue our research, we can pass time by scanning at sites like this one. On your order, we'll start our scans on the surrounding area. Commander, one of our resistance contacts just tipped us off to a site that may be worth investigating. Commander, the Avenger... several key components of the chip implanted into your skull. My analysis reveals that its primary function was that of a conduit, passing a vast amount of data directly to your cerebral cortex. The primary connection severed much of that data is lost. Several fragments do remain, however, ghosts, if you will. Observe. Tactical combat simulations. War games. The sheer volume of encounters you were processing was astounding. It, it is truly remarkable that you survived as long as you did. Though this may seem disconcerting, there is still some good news. This chip bears a striking resemblance to a medical I briefly assisted in developing a new area of the new balance. My understanding was that the impact was intended for high level of the officer's own captain for a such an officer would be the only way to make the circuit. A greater understanding of these impacts would undoubtedly benefit us all. Advent officers have clearly been modified to allow for their subordinates to receive new orders psionically. The implanted chip is the key. The Advent officers appear to be similar, if not physically the same as the common Advent trooper in terms of power and agility. However, field reports indicate a more developed mental acuity, as the officers do provide tactical directives to the subordinate Advent forces.
easier than your last procedure, Doctor. Central, Commander. Yes, I find the process to be far less disconcerting when the subject has already expired. The results, however, it's best you see for yourself. My autopsy of the Advent Captain has confirmed the existence of an implant, similar in design to the unit I extracted from the Commander. But there are differences. What kind of differences? The data you see is being pulled directly from this Advent Captain's implant. The sequence here is essentially you, Commander. Or at least the tactical information they were processing through your mind. As you can see, the data is nearly identical. They were using you against us. Yes, however, the Advent data shows signs of decay. Removing the Commander from their network has likely caused significant damage. Network? Yes, what we're seeing here is a psionic network. These implants are capable of receiving and transmitting information, a great deal of information, somehow encoded in a stream of psionic energy. My working theory? Advent uses this network to augment the tactical readiness of its troops, as well as disseminate orders from its central command. Observe. Even in the subject's diminished condition, the implant continues to have an effect. A truly astonishing achievement. Or a weakness. Potentially. But I need direct access to their network to know for sure. I'm guessing that won't be easy. We'd need an active link. And that would mean hacking a live admin officer. Like I said, not easy. Still, it's the best lead we've got. Your call, Commander. New objective added. like we've got our work cut out for us, Commander. The Advent Captain seems to provide a means of stabilizing the link between the local subordinates and the Advent Network power itself. Commander, if we're going to try to build this skull jacket that Titan came up with, we're going to need a specialized facility to test it out. Knowing that my past surgical experience is limited, I am sure the crew appreciates that I hone my skills on fallen Advent forces before triage to the uninitiated, the common advent troopers are seen. The aliens have disguised as this glaring divergence from the human form. It is carefully designed. are ready, Commander. We can build the Skulljack whenever you... Welcome to the Proving Grounds, Commander. It seemed like a good idea to isolate some of our more experimental concepts, especially when it comes to weapons development. Can get started immediately, Commander. I'll let you know as soon as we've made progress. The 
outcome of this research can only further our advances, Commander. Despite a thorough analysis, I have yet to discover what, if any, advantage the Advent Hybrid Soldier's enormous eyes provide. Testing their visual acuity will no doubt prove difficult. I'll see that work begins immediately, Commander. I'll contact you when I have a full report of it. Fairly happy, well-fed servant. Things are going well. I can't complain. Can pay my rent, but I got a big screen TV. If I'm running in circles, I'm the last one who could tell. I know what I want, at least I think so. So who are you to question my lack of goals when I grow aware of an itch that needs scratching? No idea where, but I'm pretty sure it's there. I have made a number of interesting discoveries, Commander. Setting course for Mexico. Avenger plotting new course. Resistance continues to grow. We'll have a better chance of finding openings to strike back at Advent. As it is, we've already identified a potential target to disrupt the aliens' operations in this region. Our window of opportunity is limited, so we'll have to move fast. Setting course for Sector 8, Mexico. In position for deployment. Dr. Tygen has been looking for new methods of intercepting the aliens' data on their latest operation. And it looks like he's found the location of an exposed terminal we could gain access to. Unfortunately, Advent is already in position attempting to freeze the connection. Move in and neutralize all hostile contacts. Secure the area and recover that data. We have to stop their progress before it's too late.
Menace 15, this is Avenger. The access point we're after is just ahead. Move to secure the area. Expect hostile resistance. Moving on target location. What buffs this? This is an extremely well equipped mechanized combat unit. We'll need to look for vulnerabilities if we're going to take that thing out. Target neutralized. Need to get a closer look. Understood. Moving out. Position confirmed. Better grab everything I can. Let's keep moving. What does many people have to do with fighting? And secondly, I don't need people to help me grow up. Is that I it? drink milk. Commander, we have confirmation of the exposed access point. Accessing system. Just don't leave me behind. Got it! A 
Confirm successful acquisition of the advent files. Eliminate any remaining hostiles in the area. On it! Although they bear some resemblance to the sex toys first encountered during the invasion, their genetic structure now... Status confirmed. All hostiles are down and the area is secure. Status confirmed. Mission accomplished.
doubts about your capabilities, Commander. Excellent work, as always. Classified reports of missing civilians from across the world. Their numbers are growing. We suspect they have been taken to a nearby Advent Black Site, though its exact location remains unknown. Time is short, Commander. We need you to take charge of resistance operations throughout the world. Establish contact with the local cells and bring them into the fold. Find this black site and shut it down. Save our world. The clock is ticking. Good luck, Commander. New objective added. We're ready to move when you are, Commander. I've updated our objectives based on the latest information. You have done an outstanding job leading the Resistance, Commander. Now that we have more staff on the engineering team, we can start clearing out space for new facilities, Commander. We should keep looking for more recruits, though. We'll need them to staff the facilities once they're built. Robotic units developed by Advent seem to be wholly autonomous, capable of targeting and engaging selected units without reliance on external verification. So it falls on me to work through the initial disassembly. I fully intend on involving Shen in this process, as her knowledge of robotics far outweighs my own. There is something exciting about working under the more intense conditions found on the Avenger. Every decision, every development is of the utmost importance. The 
There's no room for mistakes here. Maybe once this is all over, we should take this ship and go colonize one of their planets. 